I have a new background again. <clears throat> so, I wonder why I get headaches when it's about 12 o'clock. Haven't had breakfast. I'm eating a 99 calorie skinny chocolate bar. And I'm drinking a cup of coffee. Because I just don't have a balanced diet. Anyone else? There go. Little, little friend. <laughs> Hi guys, hope you're all well. Hope you're having a good day. It's currently 12 o'clock. Thursday. I'm bringing to you today a BNM and Pan on Hall. Okay, let me just start by saying I was expecting to go in b and and there'll be like so much like autumn winter stuff like loads of like I don't know what I was expecting to get but what I got wasn't really what I was thinking I was going to get basically and I'm just like you go in there around this time and you want to see like I don't know like autumn winter decorations not Halloween decorations not Christmas decorations autumn winter like you know like leaves and stuff like does anyone else feel like that so we have b and m and pearman oh that's really heavy oh god I'm so weak i want to start with pearman because there's not really that much that i actually got from there uh so let me just dig in so first of all because i'm a little bit of a fatty and i don't know i will i'll just get hungry when i go shopping I brought some Jaffa Cakes. I really love Jaffa Cakes. They're just one of those underrated cakes, biscuits, whatever. That I think Jaffa Cakes don't have that many calories in them. And at the moment, I'm trying to watch, you know, what I eat and stuff. I'm trying to be healthy. Um, so, yeah, I'll just eat like one a day. <laughs> I love anything that's like chocolate orange. Whoever invented chocolate orange needs a big ass trophy or something. I don't even know. So, there, Jaffa Cakes. I got some LED lights, just a 10 pack. And let me just get them out. They're just little balls. And I don't really know what I'm gonna use these for, but I just thought for a pound, they're actually quite cute. I was thinking maybe I'll put them like, around my bed or, I don't know. But, I mean, I haven't got any batteries in them yet. Shall I get some and show you? I think I should. So we've got the heating on in this house right now and my window's closed because if you, if I open it you're going to be able to hear loads of background noise and I'm wearing a jumper so that's just great. Right so I've put some batteries in, let's see. Oh, I was expecting them to be a bit brighter than that but I mean that's just them. Just some little balls, you know, lot of balls, whatever. Um, but yeah, I don't really know what I'll do with them. They just kind of come in handy, cute little lights like this, don't they? I'll just switch it up a bit. And I picked up one of these little pens, because I already had one of these. You know, like the little Mrs. Hinch pens with the little diamond on. I already had one of these, but I lost it. I mean, I lose everything, so that's just not a surprise. But, you know, I'm always... I love cute pens, like... When I was in primary school, I had this big, massive Hello Kitty pencil case that I actually rubbed off to my sister. But I had all my cool stationery in it and I had like bendy pens, like cute rubbers, scented rubbers and I just had loads of stationery. And one day, I, were, I left it in my locker or something and I think there were lockers that you, that you just opened. I'm not sure, I can't remember. Like, I mean, that was like 10 years ago. No, it was longer than that. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. It was like big. Oh my God, how... Oh my god, that was literally like years ago. Okay, sorry, reminiscing. Um, and someone stole it. Someone literally stole all my stationery. Like, how trampy can you be? Anyway, so I love stationery, you know, still at my big age. And then, you know what? I was looking at the this oil and it had like a few home bits in. There wasn't that much to be honest, but I saw these little candles and there was a few different scents and I smelled this one and it just smells like a tropical island. I don't even know. It's coconut breeze and it's so nice. And it's just, you know, just a cute little candle. Cute, 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 cute. And then, say hello to my little friend. <laughs> I think this was two pound, right? 
and it's a velvet stag but i had one in a dark green probably like kind of like that color maybe a bit darker and i was torn between like the two and i thought shall i just get two but then i was like nah, i'm not gonna get two so i just picked this little guy up this little reindeer is a bit worse for wear i'm not gonna lie i mean i got it out of the bag yesterday when i got home and i'm like oh okay so he's missing a bit of missing a bit of fur there and then oh and he's got a bit of a stain on his face here so i mean you get what you pay for i suppose but i just thought for christmas like you just christmas af so this is just yeah doesn't stand up great but whatever Oh, that looks cute there, but I'm not going to leave it there because obviously it's not Christmas yet and we'll get the Grinches in the comments saying like, oh, it's not Christmas or whatever. So I'm just going to pop my little plant back there. Yeah, I wanted to buy more Christmas stuff, but I thought I'm going to hold back because it's not that time yet. We, we need to get Halloween out of the way first and then I'll go crazy. So I'll go to B&M. Oh, okay. So let's start with more and stuff. I just picked up some of the floors because, you know, we just, you know, after following Mrs. Hinch, I'm really, like, into my cleaning and stuff. I don't know if anyone else is like that. She makes cleaning fun. And I've ha I, I hated cleaning before following her. And this one's the winter morning one, and it's the, it's a big, I'm sure, I think the, the smaller size is like that, isn't it? And this is the bigger one, and I think I'm, I'm not sure how much this was. Have I got a receipt? Have I got a receipt? I've got a receipt. One ninety nine for this, and it's the two hundred and fifty mil. You know what? I haven't smelled this yet. I can't even explain what it smells like. It just smells Christmasy. Eh? I picked up a winter spice one. I haven't smelt this one yet and I'm hoping I like it because sometimes I'm funny with winter spices. Like, I don't like... I love the smell of pine from a Christmas tree, but you know the Yankee Candle green one? Oh, my sister had it before. I smelt it and it... Mm. Literally, I hate it. Oh, I'm hoping this smells nice. Um, But yeah, winter spice. Probably the, best, the most autumn-y thing they have in there. I'm not going to lie. This kind of reminds me like... Victorian houses. You know why? Because a lot before when I went on this trip, we went, I think it was like Bliss Hill or something like that. It was like Victorian town. I don't smell it again. They, all the rooms smell like this, like old oranges <laughs> and just spicy. But that smells really nice. I always see people use this on their eyebrows. And I thought it was like, you know, like one of those American products like Airspun. The airspun powder. I don't know if anyone knows what I mean by that. But I always see it on like, people's like Instagram videos and stuff. And they use this on their eyebrows. I picked up these. Pear soap. Because literally everyone writes about it going in their eyebrows and stuff. And at the moment I just literally just use normal soap. So I thought let me just try this. And, and get four bars. So this will last me for a lot of time, to be honest. And yeah, basically what people do is they just start like, wet it, put their spoolie on, and then you just brush it for your eyebrows. So I don't know, have I been living under a rock or what? Because I literally didn't know. <laughs> I don't know what I thought, but yeah. I just picked up that just because I wanted to put it in my eyebrows. I got this little candle, because it comes on the stand. This was four pound. And it's so heavy. It's like a two wick candle and it's sweet pea. Now, if anyone knows about Bath, Bath and Body Works, sweet pea, moisturiser, then you'll know how nice it smells. Because that's the only thing I know that really, because I never really see sweet pea scents anywhere, to be honest. So that's the only thing I can like compare it to. And oh, it just smells so nice and fresh and lovely so obviously i like how it comes on this little stand because you could probably you reuse that for something as well um and yeah i mean who doesn't like candles at this time of the year oh, 
this isn't really a wintery scent but it's just it smells so nice so yeah i obviously love how this is gold i'm a gold person not a silver so we love it we love that and yeah just a little, little, little candle last thing i picked up from b and sorry this was a bit of a short haul but like i said there wasn't that much in there and i mean i wasn't just gonna buy stuff for the sake of it so i just picked up this little basket it's a native tribe storage basket and it's three pound and i just love the vibe i mean let's just i mean that doesn't really go <laughs> i love how i'm just using this for my for my props but um i thought you know like if you just want to put chargers or like you could put tea lights in there or makeup or hair bands or i don't know it's just good for for everything this is and it's like obviously a nice little size can wear it as a hat <laughs> oh, i actually make myself laugh so much i mean imagine if i was stuck in a room on my own i wouldn't be bored I tried to pick up some stuff that was like relevant do you know what i mean to the time yeah that is literally everything that i got from bnm fairland uploading every week so if you could subscribe can keep up with me and this beautiful face <laughs> joking um if you do want to follow me on instagram keep up with my life see how i style clothes and shit because that's literally all i do on there and talk crap on my stories then follow me i'll put that here hope you all have a good day hope you all have a good weekend i'll see you next week bye bitches Mwah.